This video will demonstrate recommended procedures for tapping the wide body EF high volume tapping tee with the no blow tapping tool. With the fitting fused to the main, the service line connected, the cooling times expired, and the pressure test complete, the fitting is now ready to tap. In this demonstration, we're using the T-handle version of the no-blow tapping tool. You may have an alternate version, designed to work in conjunction with a 3 quarter inch square nut female ratchet wrench. The operation of both are virtually the same. Begin by inspecting the three components as shown here the snap ring located just above the 5 8 hex at the base of the tapping tool, the O-ring in the face of the seal head, and the snap ring that is just above the cap, the positive stop. All three must be in place and undamaged for the tool to work properly. Remove the cap from the fitting. The cutter is always pre-positioned roughly halfway down the chimney of the fitting in the middle of the outlet for the pressure test. We need to bring it to the top of the chimney. So insert the 5 8 hex into the hex socket brooch on the top of the cutter and turn the handle counterclockwise as shown. Once the cutter is seated against the ID O-ring of the high volume tapping tee tower, mate the safety nut on the no blow tool to the threads in the cutter and tighten to hand tight. Now mate the cap on the tool and the seal head with the top of the tapping tee chimney and tighten the cap. Turning the tapping tool clockwise as shown. Continue turning clockwise until the positive stop is reached. The main has now been tapped. Reverse the tool, turning it counterclockwise until the cutter is seated against the ID O-ring on the tower. If at any point the cap backs off while reversing the tool, re-tighten it before proceeding. Remove the tapping tool cap lift the seal head and verify that the ID O-ring is captured in its seat. At this point, there should be virtually no gas escaping. If the O-ring is puckered and gas is escaping, re-tighten the cap on the tower of the tapping tee, run the cutter back down a few turns and reverse again. Once a seal is obtained, disconnect the safety nut from the cutter and remove the tapping tool. Replace the fitting cap and tighten the seal. Soap the cap to confirm the seal. For comprehensive instructions, please refer to the EF installation manual or for more information on George Fisher Central Plastics EF Fusion System and the assembly of components, visit our website at centralplastics.com. Additionally, hands-on training can be scheduled via the website or by contacting your local GF representative.